I'm working on a book. Here's the plotting. So I am on chapter 20, which started on page 377. And the 382 is the page I started on this morning, so I know how much to do. And shockingly, I just, as I'm sharing this with you, there are typos in this. So apparently when I finished my plotting, I chose not to run spell checks. <laughs> There's that, uh, yeah. So this is what it looks like every morning when I sit down to write each of these is a scene. Um, and this is for, oh, don't tell me, the 2024 Christmas book, which we cannot get a title for. Um, the current title floating is The Family Christmas Cabin, I think. Do you know, Janelle? I do not know. Okay. I know, I'm going I know to one check of the with my agent tomorrow. One, one of the rejected ones was Oh, the Joy. Yeah, they don't like, I had many sarcastic, uh, I'll just tell you guys, no one else knows this. Um, hold on, Annalise, regarding my title. I really did write that post-it. Oops, you can't see it. There we go. Um, so I got this great idea for Christmas book and about an adult. She's in her 50s. Julie's in her 50s and she has adult children. Great relationship. She she runs a, a tow truck company, which I love about her. And um, she has a new boyfriend and she's really tight with her kids, especially her daughter, but hasn't told them about the new boyfriend because the new boyfriend is, a little bit younger, like 12 years younger. And she's kind of, Julie could like take on the world, but she's a little bit embarrassed about the younger boyfriend. So hasn't said anything. So the plan is that a big family Thanksgiving, she was with her family. The boyfriend was with his, he's getting his floors refinished and the inside of his house painted. So he's going to move in with her for the two weeks of, of Christmas. And his ex-wife has his children. And it's going to be great because her kids have their own stuff to do. And she and the boyfriend have not spent as much time together as they would have liked. So they're going to have this whole Christmas time. Except for reasons we don't need to get into, the adult children decide they want to have Christmas as a family at the big family Christmas cabin up in the mountains. So she has to confess about the boyfriend she has to tell the boyfriend and then complications ensue that I can't tell you. So I wanted to call it don't come home for Christmas, but Janelle felt that was negative and readers would not like that. And it turns out marketing agreed with her. So then we went with, Oh, the joy because and there was, they thought I was being sarcastic, which I was, but I'm shocked. They saw through me. And there was another, oh, a big, was it a big fat family, happy, a big happy family Christmas? Something like that. Yeah. What one Maybe. big happy family Christmas, I think. Yes. And I thought that would be great. Yeah. Less Which we were on. also saying sarcastically in our heads. And apparently, but again, less pressure about. on the art department because there's really not room for much of a picture. So, and now we're down to, I really, I submitted the idea under the Christmas cabin, but this is not a book. This is really funny. And the Christmas cabin just doesn't sound funny. Comments, welcome. Um, Kath, if Catherine you says, don't on, come home for Christmas would have intrigued her. Yeah, I'd love to know. So anyway, so that's, that's the, that's what I'm writing.